had an incident not long ago that wasn't great for Australian boxing, and unfortunately it involved two of the rising stars, Alamar and uh, Kickett. Ahmed Alamar, he, he absolutely took the fight to Willie Kickett. Uh, we started the year, we said, Willie Kickett's going to be the next big thing of Australian boxing. And in the opening seconds, he had Ahmed Alamar in a little bit of trouble here. And I thought Ahmed Alamar might go down himself. And all of a sudden, you see him actually wind up here. And Willie Kickett, as he moves in for the kill, gets taken out with one knockout punch. And he was knocked out before he absolutely hit the canvas. And we saw, there it is there, and he goes down. He couldn't even get up. But unfortunately... What it sparked was the ugly scenes that is all too common in boxing. Now, what's been the fallout from the riot which this caused uh, in Australian fighting? The first thing, I was there that night with Andy Raymond calling the fight for Fox Sports, and the first thing was the guys who were doing the worst things aren't part of Australian boxing. They're all the hangers-on. I didn't see guys that I know in Australian boxing doing the worst things. There was a review by the Australian Boxing Federation. That's going to continue into, into, uh, in March. But... You see these scenes, we don't want an Australian LMR's boxer. LMR's trainer, if I'm right, he went straight uh, to kick it as soon as he jumped. They, his corner um, was concerned about the opponent's welfare. And as you, as you quite rightly say, Paul, it was the outsiders, the hangers-on who want to big note themselves. Those involved in, in the fight went straight to the, the man on the canvas. Well, that was Billy Hussain, one of the best men in Australian boxing you ever yeah. meet. And uh, look, the good people in Australian boxing were trying to just calm this thing down. Unfortunately, it got out of control and that sort of news went around the world. Not good for Australian boxing, but a great win for Ahmed Elmer.